Hello everyone, welcome to the RoboSim Virtual Robotics class. In this lesson, we will learn the basic application of line patrol with five light sensors. First, we need to know in which scenarios the robot will use the five light sensors to patrol lines. We can first log in to the RoboSim software, click on training section on the homepage, then find the outward bound, select and click on training venue 2. Take a look at this training venue. By observing, we can see that there is a black line that guides the robots to walk. The guiding line is relatively thin and has a variety of curves and junctions. This requires the robot to be able to recognize the different curves and junctions. We can have the robot patrol the lines using five light sensors. Then, we need to learn about the principle of line patrol with five light sensors. In order for the robot to have the above functions, it is necessary to use light sensors first so that the robot can distinguish between the white field and the black guide line. In short terms, photoelectric sensors can distinguish the color depth of objects. When in use, you can choose to return analog or digital values as required. Next, let's build a robot with five light sensors. We can install five photoelectric sensors on the Exploration 1 robot built in the software and connect the five photoelectric sensors to the P1, P2, P3, P4, P5 ports of the controller in turn. At this point, many of you may be wondering why five photoelectric sensors are used for line patrol instead of two or fewer photoelectric sensors. Because if we want the robot to be more stable when patrolling the line, we need the robot to be able to make different magnitude of turning movements according to different curves. For example, the robot makes small turns when it encounters small curves and large turns when it encounters large curves. Photoelectric sensors P2 and P4 are used to detect small curves and photoelectric sensors P1 and P5 are used to detect large curves, and photoelectric sensor P3 is needed to assist the robot in turning at junctions so that the robot can return to the line accurately. For beginners, the use of the 5-light sensor patrol is much simpler and easier to understand. 